ourselves who we are and what we have to offer. Wait, you're looking for more settlements. You mean you're already trading with other groups? Maggie's put it together. Your world's about to get a whole lot bigger. Maggie's the smartest one in the group. Taking all the heavy hitters with him. Which isn't exactly the brightest move. No, he's not leaving anybody behind, really. Carol, mm -hmm. I guess. Well, yeah. I, don't, I don't. I didn't see Carol. I so. didn't see her there, but I, I might have seen her in the promos. I don't remember. I love the soundtrack though. The western kind of the sound is really. It's cool. For the record, I see rain coming. I'm wearing galoshes. Did he just tell him to double bag it next time? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Open the gates, Cal. That is so hilltop. Yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh, it's uncanny. <laughs> I wonder where they built this set. It's gotta be right down the street from where Corey used to live. Probably. <laughs> it's like his neighbor's house. <laughs> Mom, Rick, we have a community. Why don't you all go get cleaned up? We're fine. And Jesus will show you where you can get washed up. Then you come back down here when you're ready. It's hard to keep this place clean. don't like Gregory, that's awesome. I know, they did a good job. Yeah. You think she's subtle? And then he, he's thinking about somebody. Gregory. Natalie, right? Maggie. That's pretty close. Not really. <laughs> I don't think he said, do you think she'd settle? He said, do you think shit settle? Like, do you think they should settle? Maybe. Jesus told me your group saved Dr. Carson. Obviously. Oh, I hate him. I hate him so much. He's awesome. <laughs> yeah, I think he said, You think shit's settled. I saw more rewind it and see. I'm pretty sure that's what he said. It sounded like he said, Do you think she'd settle? No. I can't tell, because it also almost sounded like Abraham said, do you ever think about her? But this implies that they've had a future conversation about the person that he's interested in. Or a past conversation, you know what I meant. Can't ever think about it. Settling down. You think she'd settle? It sounds like, do you think she'd settle? And the second time, it, Abraham definitely said, do you ever think about it? It, yeah. Yeah. But I can't say, if, can't tell if he's just mumbling. Settle down. You think shit's settled? I it's, can't tell if he says, you think shit settled, or you think she'd settled. <laughs> I, I think it's she. I think he's saying she. Or it's too expensive. Not T-Mobile. Introducing them. Hey, them. Clapping everybody else. Where's Tim? Marsha? They're dead. Negan? Okay. Yeah. We had a deal. You said it wasn't enough. Was the drop white? No. 
They still have Craig. Said they'd keep him alive. Return to us. I delivered a message to you. Tell me. Sorry. He's gonna kill him. There was a, an assassination attempt in the comics, so this is pretty close. Mm -hmm. I don't think Gregory's going to die. This is where they're going to cut a deal that Rick's group will fight the saviors yeah. for them in exchange for supplies. He's been struggling with whether he should end things with Rosita and start with Sasha or not, and I think he just he almost died and he saw Sasha, and now he's made the decision that it's going he's going to leave Rosita for Sasha, so he's going to die. This episode makes me think that Maggie is not going to be switched with Glenn because she's already taken leadership roles at Hilltop. Yeah. Like she was talking with Gregory. It feels like they're priming her to become Gregory. Yeah. So I which don't still, think Which she's makes going me say, I, th I think it's pointing to Glenn the not dying still and not Daryl. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Me too. I don't think they're going to change that. I think it would be a mistake too. Yeah, me too. It's necessary for Maggie. Yeah. Just like Carl getting shot in the eye. I'm so glad they did that. It's totally necessary for yeah. Carl to become who he is in that. Yeah. He's a, he's a badass in the comic. Yeah. He's still, he's still, he's still kind of a little hard, hard headed and, and stubborn and yeah. doesn't, you know, he, he goes out and does his own thing a lot and gets in trouble a lot. Mm -hmm. But he's a badass. Well, how many people does Negan have? We don't know. We've seen groups as big as 20. All of them. So they show up, they kill the kid, and you give them half of everything. These dicks just got a good story. Boogeyman, he ain't shit. Why do you know? A month ago, we took this guy's out PDQ, left him in pieces and puddles. Yeah, we'll do it. If we go get your man back, kill Negan, take out his boys, will you hook us up? We want food, medicine, and one of them cows. <laughs> one of them cows. This is bad news for the arrow. It's something we've had trouble with. In the comic, he was glad he gave that speech. I'll take it to Gregory. No, I think it was Carl. I think Carl stowed away. Yeah, Carl did stow away. They have food. We don't. We don't have enough of anything. I'm Payne. Also, actor, rapper, producer, Kid Cudi, and the one and only Maggie, Lauren Cohan. They I'm had to do that because people know now. Yeah, people know that when they say that, somebody's going to die, so they're, yeah. they're having to 